All right, guys, we're back with round four Edison format at Epic Cars and Games in Hearst, Texas. We got Donnell on the left playing Black Wings and Aaron on the right playing Six Samurai. So Aaron starts off by activating Upstart. So we actually saw these two play in the previous tournament. Aaron was Aaron won there, so it's kind of a rematch, same decks. And yeah, uh, I think I said in the previous video, Aaron only plays on Wednesdays, so I always try to get him on camera because he's the only Samurai player. And my local. Ooh, so he opens... Oh, wow, he opened the combo. Uh, hand, Grandmaster, Shogun. So if Donnell had been playing Dragon Turbo, this would be like a great opening. But unfortunately, Donnell's not playing Dragon Turbo. So I wonder what face down Aaron set. Did he set like a Starlight Road or something or a Solemn Judgment? But unfortunately, Donnell's playing Black Wings, so... Okay, Donnell also upstairs, but now he can't play any more spells. <laughs> I think he's got all trap cards in his hand, though. I mean, Icarus would be okay here, so... All right. So Donnell's taking his sweet time. He's reading Shogun. Yeah, if he controls two Samurais, he can special summon great Shogun. Let's see. So Donnell decides to set three. I think he's going to set... I think he's going to try to Icarus him. But we saw Donnell in the previous tournament get blown out by Starlight Road. Uh, do you see? Do you pop the hand here? Oh, he does. I don't think this was worth it. Maybe he's not pre-playing Donnell. That's another thing. Plus, Donnell doesn't always play Black Wings. Sometimes he plays Amaryllis. Sometimes he plays Vayu or GBs. So... I can see why, but now, oh, man, he gets punished. Yeah, Icarus, Tribute, the Blizzard, and what's he going to target? So, yeah, pay the cost for Blizzard. Choose both monsters. Let's hope he remembers Grandmaster's effect. Yeah, he remember. Why even target the Grandmaster in that scenario? I think he should have gone for the back row, Donnell. And then, yeah, I don't know why he didn't go for the back row. That's surprising. All right, uh, Aaron normal summons Iru, Iru. I don't know how to pronounce it. Now I'm, I really want to know what Aaron's back row is. So Donnell's hand is Shura, Blizzard. Yeah, Shura, Blizzard. I mean, what are you afraid of? Donnell reading Grandmaster. I think he's trying to see if he's got another Grandmaster. So he chose, okay, so he chose to bottomless because he didn't want Aaron to drop a Grandmaster. And I think that's why he did it. So Donnell attacks Aaron for 18. Yeah, so they, they were both at 9,000 due to upstart. All right, here comes Hand. So does Aaron have another Grandmaster that Donnell was afraid of? Looks like he did have it the previous turn. So Hand, Special Summon Grandmaster. Yeah, that back row shouldn't have been there. I think Donnell should have just uh, popped the Shogun. And now... The Solidarity wouldn't have been there. Ooh, double Solidarity. So Aaron's going all out with the continuous spells. So he's definitely playing, like, I bet more than one Starlight Road. So, yeah, that thing's at gain 16. So it's at 32. 3,200 hand and 3,700 Grandmaster. Okay, this should be a 3,200 hand. Now, Donnell's at 39. Let's see. What can Donnell do here? He can go Blizzard for Shura. What do you make? What do you make here? Goyo, you got to deal with these uh, solidarities. Donnell reading Grandmaster again. <laughs> uh, I, I, don't, I don't know the rest of Donnell's hands, so... Maybe you could like Brio bounce one of the one of the solidarities or bounce both solidarities, attack over hand. How many cards are in Donnell's hand? I don't know. Okay, so he does go for Brio. Yeah, so he's got two. Oh, he has Dark Arm. That's a ghost rare dark arm. Because I took Donnell's QCR. <laughs> okay, yeah, this is unfortunate for Aaron. Dark Arm wins games. I think Donnell was cooked if he didn't have Dark Arm. Or Heavy. Heavy would have been good too. Heavy, the two solidarities. 
So yeah, just pop both solidarities, right? And then wipe his field. Leave Aaron with basically two cards, and Grandmasters are really bad at top decking. And especially you're staring down Dark R and Brio. Dark Hole's not legal, so yeah, this is... Yes, Dark Arm. How many times, for those of you guys who, who watch the channel frequently, how many games has Dark Arm won? It is just. Dark Arm, Trap Dust Shoot, Brain Control, Gores. Those are the big four I can think of that just win countless games. All right, so the normal summons. This, is, I think he's alive by 100. Oh, no, Aaron Scoops. So, Donald takes game one thanks to Dark Arm. Let's see if Aaron can fight back game two. But Aaron, like, didn't draw much. With Samurai's... I, <clears throat> I don't know how you can make this deck work in Edison. Or not work, but, like, make it more consistent. But they have to see, like, the Gateways, the United, and Grandmaster. It's just tough. All right, so Donnell's hand is Gale, Sirocco, Kalut, Upstart, Bottomless. Oh my god, Donnell's hiding the spells and traps. So he sent back the Gale. Never mind, he didn't hide the spells and traps. So Donnell's hand is Sirocco, Kalut, Upstart. What is it? Bottomless. Oh, he drew a Blizzard. Okay, so he's got... But what do you do here, though? So he decides to normal summon Kalut. Hits Aaron for 14. So what he said, bottomless deep prison, right? Now Aaron's got four back rows. See, a lot of times, like, it, with now that I saw Solidarity, I'm, I'm going to guess that not all of Aaron's trap cards are real. Like, I'm going to guess a lot of them might be like Starlight Road, Dark Bribe, uh, Bluff Spells. Oh, see, he already has one Starlight Road in his hand. So he either has Bribe or another Road. But I think he doesn't want to clog up his back rows in case he draws, like, another Gateway United or something. Okay, here comes Allure. So what do you get rid of? So you, you get rid of the Sirocco that Aaron already knows you have. Pokes for 14. So what's life? 34, 8,000. So Donnell has Compulse. I don't like Compulse against Samurai. I guess what Donnell would do is, like, on the normal summit of a Samurai, he'll just Compulse him right away so that he doesn't... So that he can't special summon Grandmaster? That's like the only reason I keep that card in. So Aaron's at 2,000. He's been getting just poked by Kalut. All right. So Aaron's going to go for the dice and hits the D prison. Yeah, so the other one's bottomless, and I think the middle one was Compulse. Oh, Aaron sided D Fissure against uh, Black Wings. That's okay. I'm not a big fan of D Fissure against that deck. Okay, so Aaron was probably forced to Mirror Forge just because he's already taken so much damage. Plus, a Kalut kills him here if Donnell has another Kalut. Maybe he does. Maybe he's going to solve him this Mirror Forge because he's debating it. Or either A, that new card he set was Mirror Forge. Not Mirror Forge, sorry. Icarus or Compulse. Maybe he thought about compulsing the Kalut. That's why, that's why he took a while. But see, if I'm Aaron, I wouldn't read Compulse. I would probably read Icarus. I was like, why didn't you Icarus me here? That's what I would think if I was uh, Aaron, unless Donald's holding it for something else. Okay. Oh, man. Aaron plays Torrential and Mirror Force. Mirror Force, I understand, but Torrential and Samurai, is, ooh, I don't know about that one. So now you know for certain Donald... Doesn't have Icarus, but me knowing Donnell, I think he sided it out because he doesn't want Aaron to blow him out with with Starlight Road. Okay, so here comes Gateway United, Normal Summon Sanji. Donnell's checking his life. Maybe he's going to solemn this. Oh, no, Bottomless, but he still gets... Okay, bribed the Bottomless. So he was going to get the counters no matter what, unless if Donnell, like, solemn. Oh, okay. So this is what this is what I talked about. Compose. So he composes the Sanji so that Aaron can't drop a Grandmaster, and Aaron's at three thousand two back rows. One of them we believe is Starlight Road because I saw it in his hand. 
We need to start side decking Fairy Wind. Look at all these continuous spells. Gateway, Unite, a Black Whirlwind, and Aaron also has Defissure in hand. <laughs> but I can tell he's trying not to clog his spells and traps. That's why he's not playing Defissure and stuff. Okay, Donald searched a Blizzard, not the Gale. That's interesting. Aaron's at 3K, so oh, I think he already has a Gale. He, he redrew it after... Okay, yeah. Attack for 14. Widespread Ruin, so highest attack. That's a weird, because I'm so used to the other Widespread Ruin. This, I guess this is a new art. I forgot, there was a reason why they cited that card. Oh, Dark. I can't, I can't anymore. I think the back row is rose, so he chooses the gateway. Ugh. <laughs> yeah yeah god i hate dark arm like aaron was in a he was in a bad spot but dark arm just and like now what, what's aaron gonna do okay you you you, you need grandmaster okay d fissure oh he didn't have the grandmaster but don't know now he has no more darks Ooh, that i like that card i've all i, I really really like this card Okay, luckily Aaron doesn't play triple star that road, but now we know he plays two. That was a bad hit by on Donnell's end. But Torrential's gone. Mirror Force is gone. What are you afraid of? Yeah, Torrential's gone. Mirror Force is gone. Just go in. Yeah, Summon Shura, Trigger Whirlwind. And don't you have Gale too? Aaron needs to scoop because this game is over. Like, I can't think of anything that Aaron could have. Maybe a needle ceiling if you're side, deck, side decking that. Which is a card I've been thinking about side decking. And side decking is certain decks. I've seen a uh, shout out to Prince and Ryan and I. They've, they've been siding it. I might have to side that card too. It might be good in some matchups. So I don't know what they're thinking about, but. This is not looking good for Aaron. I don't know. Still hasn't used his Gale, right? He's still got the Gale in his hand. I don't know what they're arguing about. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not looking good for Aaron. Unless he's thinking about Solomon. Oh, he chains Dust. Okay, that's what he thought about. Uh oh. But now, if you're Donnell, you have Gale. Just special summon the Gale. What? What? Oh, Bray. Yeah, that's gay. So quick 2-0, I think Donnell still would have won. A dark Arm just, uh, just sealed it. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that duel, and we'll be back for top eight. Luckily, Aaron and Donnell both made top eight. Uh, there was, uh, we had 17 players. Three X2s got in. Donnell got like uh, third or fourth, I can't remember. Anyways, we'll be back soon for the top eight. Bye, guys.